smooth. It's real smooth. Well, it's great. It's I mean, there's a reason he picked it out. It was gonna econo be, mode. He wanted to take it for a spin, but. Economy. It's an eco mode. Neighbors say I'm getting too much paper. I got a Pink slip, bitch, I got that cat in my pocket, yeah, pink slip And I'm doing the dance, off the lot, yeah, pink slip Nigga, this a hot, bust, this shit, I ain't coming with no pink slip And I got little friends with me, and he ride with a 30 clip Nigga, don't get your ass flipped, fuck where I get your ass dipped I'm clever, nigga, they all get killed Yeah, pink slip, my nigga shice to with them sticks, so don't get popped, nigga What's up, you guys, man? This your boy, Real to Real, man Back here with another video, hey, man, say, man, hey, man it's your boy, man, real to real. Y'all already know what it is. Y'all know top of the morning, man. I'm starting off um, getting up by grinding. Um, everything just about to change. You know what I'm saying? Um, my grind about to go up just a little bit more. I'm about to do a little bit more, you know, try to accomplish a little bit more. And that's just what it is, man. We're going to keep trying to move in the pace that we move in. Like I always tell you guys, man, I'm always thinking about business adventures and stuff like that. So right now, today, I'm headed to um, go look at this one vehicle that I potentially might get. And um, I'm just thinking business, man. Um, and I'm thinking about I can use it sometimes or I can tow with the vehicle, things like that. But I'm thinking business. So... Like I say, trying to make liabilities into assets, you know what I'm saying? Make everything I own, you know, be an asset to me. You know, the charger I use for YouTube videos to make money off of the old schools, you know, same thing, you know. Make sure you guys enter the Corvette C8 3LT on 22-inch 4G autos. Make sure y'all enter that raffle. Um. Make sure y'all enter that giveaway today. Only $25. You know, who? anybody can spare $25, man. I'm telling y'all, like, right now, like, what's so crazy is we blow so much money a day, but y'all don't want to take a, y'all, but y'all have to take a chance on an investment. Like, a 3LT Corvette on 22 inch 4 autos that would change your life. I don't care what nobody say. Or $50,000. And second place winner get $5,000. Third place winner get a PS5. That any, any of those things would help somebody. And I wouldn't say the five or the PS5 would change somebody's lives, but Somebody out there want a PS5, they can't get a hold of one. Somebody need 5,000 right now, cash, no matter what circumstance they in or what position in life they in, somebody need that money. $25 to win either of those things, plus on top of that, you get $50,000 if you win the car, if you don't want the car, cash. And y'all, this is no cap. This is no cap. Me and him teamed up to do this. We are giving y'all 50,000 cash if you don't want the car. Now, if you want the car, man, we're going to ship the car back to you. You don't have to drive it back. None of that. We're going to ship the car back to you. We're going to fly you in. And you're going to be able to hang with us for the day. Ride around with us for the day in your new C8 Corvette while we're in our Hellcats, you know. You're going to be able to do that with us. Like, we're just going to have a good time, a good day. Like I say, if you guys starting YouTube channels, this will be something good for you guys to invest in yourself. Because if you win, come on, you're going to blow up. You got a C8 Corvette from real to real. Something big. On 22 inch 4G autos. Come on, man. I haven't seen no giveaway on YouTube this big. Not a C8. Not a 3LT C8. You know, this ain't the cheap boy. 
Come on now. Ain't none of them cheap. Don't get it wrong. Ain't none of them cheap now. But this the top of the line. Carbon fiber package. All that. Fully loaded. So, like I said, make sure you guys hit the link in the description. Make sure you guys enter. It's only $25. We blow that on gas every day. We blow that on snacks every day. We blow that on food every day. We blow that on drinks every day. Hey, think if you want to change your life or not. The Corvette can change your life for that $50,000. Just think about that. Let it sink in your head. Guarantee it will change your life if you win. You know what I'm saying? So, like I say, dang, I, man, I bust this bump on my, on my goddamn face. That's why I hate this hair on my face. Always breaking out, man. Always breaking out. I'm getting my hair cut today. I ain't going on another week this time. Shoot, I missed my barber's appointment last week. But not this, not this week. I ain't missing nothing. I hate breaking out. But, like I say, make sure you guys come to the car show. October 24th, Holly Springs, Mississippi. And I just got booked for another car show. October 23rd. October 23rd. I will be in Oklahoma. Oklahoma. I'm going to have the flyer up on the screen so y'all can see. I will be in Oklahoma, you guys. So, um, I forgot which one. Let me let me look at the flyer real quick. Let me see what, what city it is. Let me see what city it is, man. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Tulsa. Tulsa right right. Tulsa Raceway Park. Tulsa Raceway Park. I will be there as one of their special guests. So make sure you guys come out to Tulsa, Oklahoma. Make sure you guys do that. You know what I'm saying? Um Dunk Mouse and them, all them gonna be there. Um it's just gonna be a lit event. So make sure you guys come out. And then right the next day, I'll be in Memphis, Tennessee at Holly Springs Motorsports. Yes, yeah, sir, buddy. So, uh, like I say, I'm working, I'm grinding. If you guys want to book me, make sure you reach out to me um, or my manager. The link will be in the description to my manager. And on Instagram, make sure you guys follow me on Instagram. But that's where you'll know about some of these things before they happen. And you'll get the update on a lot of things. That's how you keep in touch with me. That's how you keep track of your boy real to real, man. So we finna head out here. I got a little minute, got like a 30, 35 minute drive. Um, and we're gonna go look at this potential new vehicle. So appreciate y'all. Love the support. Catch y'all in a minute. Peace. Okay, y'all, man, it's a little bit cloudy outside, um, but I was coming out here, um, actually coming to look at this truck and make sure it's something that, make sure it's the one I want. Make sure coming up. Check out this Escalade right here. It got chrome all on it, but I mean, it literally caught my eye because of the inside. Like, I can get everything else blacked out. I'm not too much worried about um, none of the chrome, even the wheels. I can get blacked out on it. Those not factory wheels, I don't think. No, they're not factory Escalade wheels. I think they're just... Uh, Just regular wheel. Hey, how you doing? Good, how are you? All right. You're checking this one out? Yeah. I've got the keys, I think. Were you the one I was talking to earlier? I guess so. Cool, cool. Clay? Clay, yes, yeah, sir. Yeah, yeah. Nice to meet you, man. Uh, real. Nice to meet you. Well, Mariel, that's my real name. Okay. Yeah, yeah now I was looking at it. So these are not factory wheels. Those aftermarket. I couldn't tell you. 
I yeah. Saw, I saw these dinky little Supers all day. <laughs> yeah, I know. Yeah, they at the market. I can, I can tell. Oh yeah, I'm sure they are. They don't have the, uh, the hubs or anything. Yeah, yeah, they don't have the Cadillac symbol in the middle of them, and the tires a little bit bigger. My, uh, my GSM is gonna be all disappointed. He just put his plate on this morning. Oh, seriously? He, he could demo it. Oh yeah, yeah. Now I, I've, I've been looking at quite a few. Uh, this is just the first one that I then checked out. Let me see the inside of it. Cause I know with this light interior, I was just kind of worried about the, the handprints and stuff like that. So it hasn't been through our little cleaning process yet. We still got to detail it. Okay. Uh, like I said, we just got it in a few days ago. I tried to give it a decent little wipe down, but uh -huh. we still got to get in. They come in and scrub the seats. Okay. Uh, armor all, everything, do the tires and all that stuff too. Okay. Yeah, because it is quite a bit. Uh, whoop the back. I laid that seat down too when I did that mm -hmm. video. Where I said, oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, so you just had filmed that video. Oh, yeah, I did that. Video. Oh, I thought you had already had it up. No, no, I did it this <laughs> okay, okay. I did it this morning just so you can take a look at it. I uh -huh. like it because sometimes, man, those pictures online just don't do them justice. Yeah, yeah, exactly, exactly. So I couldn't really just see because I was like, man, that kind of that light interior. Yeah. Man, that picture is not gonna show no. exactly what it looks like, so. And they put that, they put them in this big white room when they take the pictures too. Uh -huh. so sometimes the exterior- It brightens it up. Yeah, yeah, exactly, exactly. But it's got, the, it's got the power switches and everything too for the third Yeah, row yeah, on the set. side, yeah. Usually mostly all of them come with that. Yeah. yeah. I still a cool vehicle. Well, it just need my little touches on it. <laughs> oh, uh, y'all did. It had five or six hundred miles on it. Yeah, yeah, those yeah, those twenty twenty ones. They some big major trucks. But, uh, uh, but I mean, I always like this this model right here. I'm I'm not gonna say. I mean, I like I like what everybody else doing with there, but I'm just not into those those ones. I like this model better and you know everybody, everybody just have their preference yeah. you know not everybody wants to spend one hundred and thirty thousand dollars on one either so <laughs> yeah well that too that's a big major factor yeah. now i just never been a fan of the front of them gotcha. you know I, I think this front just look way better yeah, just like that you know yeah. yeah i wish they would have just redesigned that type front end but you know they didn't they had to yeah they put a whole twist to it oh, yeah. i don't think i was into that twist <laughs> but yeah it's decent uh, uh what the driving ability is like uh do you want to test drive it, drive it or? absolutely yeah let me uh, i just need a driver's license okay and i'll uh we got a plate on that so okay oh, oh. start it up like i said it didn't let me see PEI the... either Oh, okay. Any of the surface scratches and stuff like that, we buff all that stuff out. Okay. Any okay. Chips and stuff, we try to make sure because the car's going to be on the road. It's going to have a couple of chips in it. Yeah, yeah, so yeah, definitely. Sure definitely. I mean, it's a used vehicle still at the end of the day, so I do understand that. But this one kind of a, it's kind of more cleaner than some of the ones that have the black interior, to be honest. So, you know, it's just, you see where that little foot part is and stuff like that. It's a lot of that. Um, Turned on pretty smooth. Let me turn it back off and turn it back on for y'all. Seat goes up. Oh crap. I guess it got memory seats. Cause that thing just squeezed me up. I guess they put a little bit more uh, miles on it. Uh, let me see what it read online. Then they got the actual charger right here. So that's another reason I liked it. You know, USB. Whole lot of storage in here. Whole lot. Just something I just need something comfortable, y'all. It ain't about hooking the truck up and all that type stuff. Like I actually need this for like 
towing my vehicles and then been able to go out of town comfortably. And, uh, you know, other than being comfortable, I get to do business with it. So, you know, I'm trying to get into a business adventure. Yeah, let me raise that up. Trying to get my little business adventure going on. Got the Acaterra on here, the wood grain. Four digital display. I really like that. And y'all, ever since I rented that, that one up in uh, California, that's the reason why I've been wanting one ever since. But that one was an XL. This is the short one. I want the short one, the XL. I couldn't get it into spots. Well, I can get it into spots, but I was getting overly charged for everything on it. Uh, I mean, every time I parked, I was getting overly charged. I was getting charged for two spots instead of one and all of that type of stuff. And uh, I don't want to have to go through that type of stuff. Got the bowl system in it. Like all around, it's, it's still a clean truck, y'all. It's a clean truck. To be honest, my, my wife was telling me to get a white and black one to match up in, so. But uh, I can always wrap this black because I want it to be for a certain person. Oh, no, you okay. Definitely. Is that bad? <laughs> yeah. Man, you know how the world's been. Just talking to my people. Oh, you're good. You're good. I do YouTube, man. Oh, cool. Yeah. I saw all your, uh, your handles and stuff on your uh, Oh, on, your car. on my car. Yeah. <laughs> oh, you saw the car pull in? Oh, of course we all saw the car. Oh, okay. <laughs> Of course we all saw it. Oh. I usually have my GoPro with me. Oh, no, you do that. But it's okay. I kind of became a master of this. Heck yeah. I've been doing it for about <laughs> three years. Ain't nothing wrong Three, four that. years. Nothing We're probably three and a half. Let me let this down. It's a little bit hot. Well, so I can turn well, the air I was on. I was going to say the bit. air was off, I think, earlier yeah. this morning. Got the cool seats and everything too for you. Yeah, that's a little bit high. They're gonna hear it in the in the mic. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah, so I actually so what made me actually want this car, well this this SUV, um I rented one in uh Los Angeles. Gotcha. Um, I was looking to rent the 2021 and then I rented a 2021, but it's the same exact one as this one. Gotcha. And I was like, man, that truck rides so smooth, it feels like you're riding on clouds. Exactly. When you're driving, it's like, it's not like cars. Cars, you feel everything in the road. Exactly. So I was like, man, I need one of these. And then, you know, people tow with them still. Yeah, they're, you know? they're, still, they're still plenty capable. And the only, only reason I was into this other one is because it was a four-wheel drive, gotcha. you know. Um, if this one, like, four-wheel drive, be at the top, top gotcha. of my list right now. I um, But still, I like this one better than the other one. Cool. No, man, these things, I mean, there's a reason everybody says something drives like a Cadillac. Yeah. So. That's the reason why everybody want a Cadillac. <laughs> that yeah, smooth absolutely. drive. It's smooth drive. That's exactly the reason why they want them. And then I like, and then I look at a lot of other things too. So, you know, some people don't look at this, but I do. Um, the color of the inside, it makes the videos brighter too. Absolutely. Absolutely. You know, if you see yourself yeah, in it, <laughs> yeah, it, it's bright. So, not gonna drown out yeah, exactly. Yeah. So, the black interior kind of. It's kind of a bummer for you. You have to always have to have the sunroof open. It do have yeah. the sunroof, so that just brings in more light, exactly. you know. So well, I mean, when you're recording, you have to have at least a sunroof, yeah. light interior, and things like that. And that air feels pretty good, pretty relaxing too. Yeah, if your life is uh, is filming, you got to think about all that stuff. Exactly, you know. Um, a lot of people just go and oh man get what they like you know I can't do that I have to think about everything exactly you know and then I have a vehicle another vehicle so I do car shows and stuff like that so is I have to tow certain cars you know gotcha. yeah. so I'm like man I can just use this vehicle for everyday purposes and towing exactly. you know exactly kind of gives you makes it what got you into selling cars well I uh I was driving a truck for a long time. Mm -hmm. and then, uh, 18 wheeler? 
No, I had a uh, just a three quarter ton. Oh, okay, okay. I was driving eighteen wheeler. Gotcha. Yeah. I was driving uh, motorcycles back and forth from uh, Flower Mound to St. Louis once a week. Mm -hmm. And then uh, I got a little baby girl at home now. Oh so, yeah. Being gone all week wasn't it? I work plenty of hours out here, but I go home every night. Mm -hmm. So that's the. That's you the had big to settle thing. in. Yeah. yeah. But I really like it. I mean, Subaru is a pretty cool little brand, but mm -hmm. still get to. We still get pretty cool little uh, other cars. Other cars in. Well, with the market right now, you have to get other cars now. Yeah. I think we've got two, maybe three new cars. New right cars. Now. Yeah. yeah. The, the, the the car market is kind of screwed up. Absolutely. I know it. Um, about a about a year and a half ago, this truck would have been cheaper. Right. You know. It's crazy, and, and we're just worried about it just getting worse. Yeah. Yeah. And then you know a lot of people um a lot of people are leasing now too because they don't want to get stuck with the yep. vehicles and overage you know on them they don't want to lose value when the market get back right. right so a lot of people leasing right now the big thing too all these people that leased in like 18 they're coming to turn them in the market's so crazy exactly. they're getting they're making money when they're, they're making to money exactly yep, yep. That's it, man. yeah that definitely uh i just had uh let a car go and uh, they gave me more than what I actually paid for the car, so gotcha. yeah. yeah no, the market is crazy it's right absolutely now. Absolutely crazy. Yeah. <laughs> I've got a couple of couple of older guys that work here say that they hadn't seen stuff like this in a long time. Mm -hmm. But it seems every time that the housing market messes up a little bit, yeah, cars are going to change a little bit too. Yep, and the housing market is crazy it's right it, now. It is insane. It is insane. You can't even find a house right now. If no. some, one go for sale, it automatically sold. Just like that. Yeah. Every time, because I'm in the middle of moving myself. So it's like, every time I see something I like, I call, <laughs> hey, it just sold. Yep. I'm there, like, man. In front of yep, <laughs> yep. Well, that was, that what it was on the last one. Gotcha. It, was, it was like a lot of people in front of me, and I was like, oh my God. <laughs> so. The chances of all of them saying no, and then you still want it. Exactly. <laughs> That's a slim to none, because they just taking what they can get right now. Absolutely. Absolutely. <laughs> so the, if that one don't take it, the next one's going to take it, because they like, oh, well, they ain't want it. Exactly. So, you know. But yeah, no, nah, this this smooth. It's real smooth. Well, it's great. It's I mean, there's a reason he picked it out. Was gonna, econo mode. He wanted to take it for a spin, but. Econo mode. It's an eco mode. Yeah, I definitely like it. This one fully loaded, right? No, absolutely. Yeah, he's got your uh, blind spot, your heated and cooled seats. Yeah, that blind spot comes in handy. It's got the, uh, the camera up front, so you can actually do the uh, adaptive cruise control. Mm -hmm. So it's going to be pacing the car in front of you. Mm -hmm. uh, 360 camera. And they put just about everything, everything on there. Absolutely. Yeah, these are wonderful vehicles. It feels like I'm riding on clouds right now. That's it, man. <laughs> I don't think this is good for me. It's gonna make the videos look <laughs> yeah, because it's, <laughs> it's not shaky. It's not shaky. But it will put you to sleep on the road. Oh, it might do, it might do that. It might I, do I travel that. a lot, so I don't need to go to sleep on the road. <laughs> well, that's it, man. You just crank up. It's got Bose sound system and everything in it. So yeah, exactly. Just crank it up, keep your weight. You know, I definitely like my music. Oops. Yeah, I'm a little country, so I say music kind of different. <laughs> <laughs> they, they call me hillbilly up here because I real? grew up up near the uh, the Red River. Oh, for real? Yeah. Yeah, I, I grew up in Memphis in uh, Arkansas. So, yeah. Yeah, I, I definitely like the feeling of this. Well, I mean, the thing it drives beautiful. And even with it being in its dirty shape right now, it's yeah, clean. yeah. So how long would it take you guys to go through the PDR process? Uh, what we've got left is we're waiting on uh, the fuel filter to come in so mm -hmm. we can change it and we're going to do an oil change on it. Okay. And then it's going to go through. So y'all literally PDR. just got this vehicle. Oh yeah, we haven't had it more than a few days. Man. Oh, okay. It's, I was getting all the uh, the fingerprints and stuff off the sides of it this morning. Yeah. Just for whenever somebody. Needed. Yeah, probably loading it up and stuff like that. But it is a, uh, it's a big old truck. Well, this one is better than the one that I rented down there because it was the XL. Gotcha. Okay. So it's like near the <laughs> and that was, they was charging me double every time I went to park somewhere. 
goodness. They was like, oh no, you can't even park in a regular spot. We have to park, we have to uh, charge you double. It, literally everywhere I went, I was paying double. So I was paying like 50, 60 bucks just to park everywhere in California. I was like, I won't do that one again. <laughs> so I knew no, I to go for the small Escalade, yep. more so the big one. So. Blame it all, man. Oh, the air works good. Wonderful. <laughs> and it's even got a, it's got a button for the. Oh, for that. Thing. I was looking all over the place to how to drop this thing down. And this, and this right up. here, I think. Hold on, if I'm not mistaken, it's something on here. It's a secret compartment. It is. So with this one, it's not because the ones that do, they have the cutouts up top. Uh -huh. I know exactly what you're talking about. Where the. Uh, the thing raises no up. this is supposed oh, to oh this one comes up. yeah yeah exactly <laughs> i was thinking See? I, I, had a, I had an impala out here the other day that did that yeah the impala it goes yeah, up yep yeah yeah but Ooh, this one comes that. out yeah heck yeah man and then everything closes up yeah makes it all nice and clean even got a little phone charger phone charger there. yeah you don't need yours because a lot of people the cigarette lighter thing goes out exactly and the usb with them fuses so Dude, man, you know it. yeah <laughs> you know it but I know they got their memory seats on because this thing ain't working for me. I didn't get out quick enough. It put, <laughs> hurry up, putting my knees up like against up. the dashboard. Ah, oh, let me get up out of here. I, I love it with the, uh, I like the, um, the other steps. When you open the door, it, it yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I definitely like those. I just wonder what it would look like with them on here because I don't know if it's paint up under that right. and if it's paint up under there it might it might be, it might be ugly once it comes off because it's been there so long so but that, that ain't something that you know can't be adjusted I have a good paint shop so <laughs> yeah And then, I mean, I wouldn't leave it red regardless. I would wrap it. You wrap it? Yeah. That's what we figured was on the car. I'd wrap yeah. it uh, black. No, that's paint. That's paint? Mm-hmm. Oh, man. Yeah, that's paint. That looks awesome. I would paint this one, but, I mean, wrapping would be quick and easy. A lot of uh, Uh-huh. <laughs> it's, it's a lot of flat spots, so uh, wrapping would be the best, you know? Sometimes when it's kind of them awkward shapes, it's not good to wrap the cars because you see a, a lot of seams in them mm -hmm. and stuff like that. But this is kind of uh, a straight flat surface. So we got our little our little cross tracks like that little red one out there. Uh huh. Uh, we uh, a few years ago in '18 they stopped making an orange one. Oh and, yeah. Uh, we had a girl who comes up about every three years and gets in a new lease. Uh huh. But we didn't have any orange ones this year, so uh, she bought a white one and we wrapped it. We didn't wrapped it orange yep. for. Her. And it oh, awesome. well, see, yeah, hey, good. you can do anything nowadays and still preserve the value of it. That's it. That's yeah. It. Okay, let's go in here and see go. what's going on. Wow, I was out here, man. I wanted to check out these scats over here. No sunroofs on them, though. Cloth seats. Yeah, both of them probably cloth seats. Oh, that one got towed up down there at the bottom. Yeah, both of them cloth seats. That blue and that orange. Yeah, they base models. Well, at least they got backup cameras on them. Yeah, they pretty much base models. Hey. Old man, old. They painted the front. Snorkels on this one. Yes, sir. Just up here chilling on it. Yes, sir. They got the blue brake calipers. They done the brake calipers on that thing. Yep, they done the brake caliber. Look at mine right over there in the corner, right there. Right there. Oh, they got a Corvette over here. It's not a Grand Sport or a, a Z06, I don't think. Nope. Nope. It ain't. Got that red interior, though. 
see it from the front. Can't really just see off of there. Little stingray, little mini jump. I just like the way the Grand Sports and the uh, Z06, they just wide, that wide body. Just, it, it killed it. But, uh, yeah, I was just up here just wasting a little time right now. Uh, trying to see if it gonna work out for me. See if the number's cool or whatever. Uh, I don't know, I, I didn't go get a chance. I was gonna go look at these other two, but I don't know, man. I got that feeling on this one. Uh, I like the interior on it. And uh, he said he gonna get them to clean up everything. He gonna get them to uh, do the PDI on it. Uh, PT, whatever it is, the, uh, the paint correction on it. He gonna do everything. He gonna get them to buff everything. He, he said he gonna have it looking like a brand new truck for me, so. Uh, yeah. What you guys think, man? Let me know down in the comment section what y'all think. Did a good buy or what? Did a good buy or what? I would definitely have to wrap it and get it on. Um, definitely have to wrap it and get it blacked out. Y'all know I don't do the chrome, but it actually looks good. It's a luxury vehicle, so. You know, that luxury package come with their chrome on it, so. The other one I was gonna look at was the all-wheel drive, um, black and white one. But, I just looked, I had looked at the reviews on the dealership that it was at, and I was like, eh, I pass on it. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes you wanna be, you wanna deal with, uh, uh, good dealership, man, when it come to these cars. I ain't sound kinda good. Got them big brakes and everything on that thing. Them little, little cars got big boy brakes. And it's all wheel drive. Those little cars come with some big boy brakes, don't they? Do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's those big old ones. Big brakes. Nice <laughs> Crazy. Got Hellcat brakes on this thing, man. Actually got Hellcat brakes on it. Front and back. They not playing. Four pistons in the back, six pistons up front. Mm, that's crazy. But yeah, let me know what y'all think down in the comment section, man. I'll get back with y'all in a minute. Stay tuned. So bad news, you guys. Hey, like I say, everything don't always go as planned. And y'all know I'm one person that's gonna let you know the real. You know, a lot of people probably won't. You know, but I will, because I really don't be caring. Um, but, so, it ain't I got denied or anything from the bank. But, it's, uh, it's a fraud alert on my social. And, you know, it's just, just one of them things. And then the dealership actually messed up the paperwork sent in that i was putting down another amount and i told them this amount and they talking about all oh, the resend is gonna take five days to do that which y'all had me in here sitting all this time you know telling me that i have to call all the credit bureaus and get the fraud uh alert taken off which i never had to do that they always called me or the, the people who they bank with um, actually calls me, the fraud department will call me and say, hey, is this you? You know, I know some of y'all have been through this. Where they, they'll ask you, is it you? Is this you the one running your credit trying to purchase a vehicle? And stuff like that. And nobody in there knew what was going on. Nobody knew how to handle it. They kept saying, hey man, your number is not up under the credit bureau. Um, they can't even call you and my number is there. How they call how they call me for how they call us for my wife's car. You know what I'm saying? Like I just bought a car two weeks ago. 
So don't tell me that it's a fraud alert that's keeping me from buying a car. So when it all said and done, you guys, I look at things. I listen, I learn, and I learn from my mistakes. Don't let your excitement get you a bad deal. Because, and the only reason I'm saying this is because I know when God is sending you a sign to tell you to hold off and wait, he going to send it in so many ways and form. And he know you can get approved for it. He know that by heart. And he's still blocking you every time something happens. So I end up calling the people and they told me they uplifting it and they removing it and um, give it like 24 hours, stuff like that. But then they not already submitted the wrong paperwork. So you can't submit the paperwork again until five days later when you messed it up. So that was another sign. That was another sign from him like, okay, got me through the first obstacle. He got me through the first obstacle. Then he brought another obstacle on me. And that was them submitting the wrong down payment request. Well, you know, the paperwork to get you the right numbers and stuff. So after that, I just took it in consideration. Like, nope, God telling me, don't do it. So I'm not doing it. I walked away from it. That's him telling me, keep going on with what you got. Keep going on with your bills. And hey, something coming for you in the future. Like I say, man, me, I'm one of them people that I never, I never put down a crazy amount of money on cars. And this time I was just jumping out the limb, just about to just throw some money down, the amount that I was throwing down, and they still messed it up. Even though I was finna give them a healthy amount of money, they still messed up the paperwork. And I'm like, man, it just is what it is. So they tell you right there, God wanted me to keep my money in my pocket and keep going forward with the bills that I already have. So, um, yeah, I appreciate y'all. Hey, it is what it is. Just one of them things, man. It's called life. I done missed a day of work and I didn't come home with the bill. And then I wasn't going to come home with the vehicle regardless because they said they had to take it through this through this uh, three-day process of cleaning it and uh, removing scratches and all that type stuff. So, hey, you guys, it is what it is at this point. I'm not mad. I'm not frustrated because I know, you know, he was looking out for me from above. So, you got to take it and run with it. So, y'all already know, man. Catch y'all in another video. It was just one of them ones where you guys can learn through me. Learn little valuable lessons on certain things. And don't let your excitement get to you. Don't make a bad deal because of excitement. But y'all already know. Your boy checking out with another video. Make sure y'all enter the Corvette, Corvette giveaway. The link is in the description of this video. So make sure you guys do that. And I'm going to catch you guys in the next video. Y'all already know what time it is. Your boy Real to Real. Hey man, say man, hey man. It's your boy man. Real to Real man. The like button, the subscribe button, that share button. Go ahead, bust it down. I'm out here like last year, man. Peace. Uh, Neighbors say I'm getting too much paper. I got Peace, look, bitch, I got that cat in my pocket, yeah, peace, look, and I'm doing the dance, all the lies, yeah, peace, look, nigga, this a hot bust, this shit, I ain't come with no peace, look, and I got Lil' Prince with me, and he ride with a 30 clip, nigga, don't get your ass flipped, fuck where I get your ass dipped, I'm clipped, these these niggas, they all get killed, yeah, peace, look, my nigga shiesty with them sticks, so don't get popped, nigga, get your knock, nigga, she popped the sand, the bitch is sleeping, sand, my coat too fast, police done see me.